Hello, it's Kritsta, and we're back. It's still in day 10 for the tower challenge. And let's get into this. So we did another round of the challenge characters, and Grandma Tala, of course, can do it. We only got two of the refresh tokens, so kind of debating which characters I should send out, but... We got the Parade Float. Trying to see if Destiny will give me another refresh token. And it doesn't look like she gave one to me. So, I kind of stinks. But let's go and just get from everybody else and just see if there's any opportunity of uh, Buzz or Tinkerbell giving us some. Oh, there's nothing from them so far. So we're going to get the rest of the characters and their tasks. And as I remember, I uh, leveled up Cinderella. So hopefully get her back in the kingdom and get her working on her next uh, kingdom storyline so Cinderella is now level three life is so divine yeah yep. she's back in the kingdom in level three so let's see who all Okay, it's about an hour for her. Right, we got Pluto free, and Prince Charming, of course, isn't free. He's the only one available for that section in the group. And then Goofy, and get him into. Yes, and uh. I'm just gonna use gems so that we can get this tower challenge round out and get it started. Okay. Let's see. Send Mickey out. Woody. Oh, Pluto. Yeah, I don't want to send him out. I think I got a minute for that one. Hmm. Not sure. I just got to going to center for the hour. And then Buzz. Person. Refresh for a refresh token. Would be helpful. And Prince Charming. Yeah, I think I actually accidentally made Pluto go do something. Yep. Oh, that stinks because I was really hoping to get a full group people for this round. So. I think, yeah, I'll just use the gems so I can get him into the tower challenge. Or get him in the group to challenge the tower. And. Your, uh, Cinderella can do her quest now. So that's good there. Waiting for a bit so that we could do that. But, okay, Sina is gonna be in the center home because she can't really collect any. 
tokens right now. Okay. Going through, trying to get rid of the wall. We can get this. Try to get some of these Maleficent coins. Which would be really helpful for the next chapter. Because if I can get all of them done, then it would be really good to start off. I don't need to like push, push. Especially because I don't know where all characters will be in the next uh, chapter tower challenge. So, yep, at least got everybody out. I'm in the 4,000 range, so same as for the first chapter. I should hopefully get uh, the 500 Maleficent coins to help out with stuff. So, which will be a great thing for starting out because I don't know exactly what all character groups are going to be included in chapter 3. The only ones I know for sure are the Little Mermaid uh, character group. And especially Prince Eric is going to be the feature character. So, yeah, I'm just going to probably go and collect all this magic around. I'm not going to collect the happiness just because I'm at 100% ecstatic. So until um the safeguard wears off i'm gonna hold try to hold off on collecting happiness so when it does wear off i'll have a bunch of happiness to add and i will be right back into the next section of the tower challenge and we're back at it so we can now collect for this group the tower challenge and get some of those coins and I'm probably I don't have any refresh coins so refresh tokens so it will probably just be Gramatala for sorry excuse me it'll probably be Gramatala for the rest of the this chapter until I mean when I get the opportunity to refresh all the characters it will be uh, the start of chapter 3 so I won't be using these characters next chapter so yeah so I'm just going through getting all the tokens and magic from each of the characters that's out and then once that's done, we'll probably send them off to work on more, getting more tokens. We have these extra Maleficent coins every four hours is really helping me this time. Considering because the first chapter, you could only tap them twice. To get Maleficent coins. Now the second chapter. I've been able to tap each of the attractions. Three times. For the Maleficent coins. So. Uh, yeah. Use, I'm able to use uh, Merlin's Gathering spell again. And. Got 2000 magic this time. I'm debating if I should like. Try to save up. To use magic magic to open up the other two plots of lands that are currently available or if I should hold off and just use it to level up more characters but I did say in an earlier video that I would like to get the plots of land as quickly as I can so that when I do get the attractions I'll have the space to put the attractions out right away and they won't have to like linger in storage not really benefiting the kingdom or anything so if I can get the land now even though it's like 
totally empty right now. If I can't at least get it, then when I progress farther in the story and any further, um, or any new, uh, events in the future, I'll have the land to place down the new attractions if I get to the point in, uh, in the attractions. An official thing if I can like get the lands open and then I won't have to be like oh well which attractions am I gonna put in storage so that I have room for the attractions coming up in whichever event is coming next or in the future so so yeah that's kind of why I would like to go for the land as soon as I can, which currently it looks like I'm at like 40 something thousand, so I just need 50,000 for the next plot of land, either in Tomorrowland or in Star Wars Land. Both of the plots of lands are 50,000 each, so but I'm thinking if I level up some characters it might take me a little bit longer to work on the land but here i'm putting the characters that don't drop any tokens i'm sending them home where and then the characters that do drop tokens i'm bringing back into the kingdom to be able to drop those tokens i mean technically i don't have that many characters so i can leave all of them out if i wanted to but Honestly, I just like to bring the characters out that have tokens that they drop. I mean, yeah, the magic's all well and good, but being it put away in the character thing just makes it so I don't have to think about their gaining magic and getting back into the kingdom. But, um, yeah, so trying to find this last chest. And probably most likely after that. After I find the chest. Yep, there it is. Mickey, Tomatala, and Ursina, one of them. Okay, well, that will be it for this video, and I will see you in the next. Bye!